So what happens when you don't have ethics in society? You start to see where people believe that you have chaos. You have other bad things happening. Why not go do whatever it is I want to do at any time? Why not engage in behavior that I want to be engaging in regardless of the outcome and who it might affect? And that's what it comes down to. When we take a look at this list of the most sinful cities across America, you're taking a look at people's behaviors, what they're doing, crimes they're committing, a lack of possible morality in what they do in their day-to-day lives. And it's no wonder that our country then and the people in our country start to act and behave worse and worse because it's spreading. Remember, we talk about inspiring others, motivating others, encouraging others. We, me, would hope that that's for the good, to try to raise the standard in our own lives, try to raise the standard in our society, like our neighborhoods and our communities. But when you start to see these cities on the list of the most sinful cities based on Things such as anger and hatred, greed, 